<laughs> new information tonight about the victim of a deadly bear attack in New Jersey. The 22-year-old man killed while hiking in a preserve in West Milford was a Rutgers University student. CBS 2's Tony Aiello has more. North Jersey is black bear country, perhaps as many as 2,400 living in the wild. The frequent encounters with humans, usually not a big deal. Don't entice them most of the time, they, they're skittish, they'll just run away. But on the final Sunday of summer, horror in the Apshua Preserve in northern Passaic County. West Milford police say five friends from Edison went for a hike. Only four made it out alive. Darsh Patel, a 22-year-old senior at Rutgers, apparently mauled to death by a 300-pound black bear. There was bite marks and claw marks on the body. The final determination depends on autopsy results, but investigators strongly believe this is New Jersey's first recorded fatal bear attack. The surviving hiker told investigators they encountered the bear in the woods and it began to follow them. They grew frightened and ran. Hiker Darsh Patel may have twisted his ankle and fallen. He became separated from the others. West Milford search and rescue found Patel dead. The bear standing guard just yards away. Generally when a predator has a kill, all right, what they will do, and black bears, uh, mountain lions will do the same thing. Um, they'll safeguard the body. A West Milford cop shot the bear dead, but the community is understandably on edge. It's pretty, I mean, it's scary because, you know, you got a lot of kids and stuff. You got a school right here. Investigators don't believe the hikers did anything to provoke the attack. The bear had never been tagged by researchers, so there's no record of its travels or background. Ironically, tonight here at the municipal building, a long planned seminar on how to coexist peacefully with black bears. In West Milford, New Jersey, Tony Ayala. CBS 2 News. And at Rutgers, friends of the victim, Darsh Patel, declined to comment, citing his family's request for privacy. The body of the bear is being examined, but experts say there's a good chance they will never determine what caused it to attack. And more information for anybody who confronts a bear or is worried about an attack, the New Jersey Department of Environmental Protection gives these tips. Make noise. Look as big as you can make yourself appear to be. Slowly back away, avoid direct eye contact, and do not run.